Let's take percentage is equal to 60. Suppose you got a percentage of 60. If condition, if this condition is true, if P, P means percentage, shortcut we have written, P greater than or equal to 80. If you got above 80%, print A grade. So how it is going to execute? If this condition is true, execute the body of this if. Here we have written only one line. You can write any number of lines in the body of the if. And you can write any statements, whatever the, again you can write if else inside this. Based on that, you have to think about the logic. So print a grade. Once this condition is true, the execution, after executing the body, the execution jumps from here to the next code. It is not going to check the remaining conditions. That is how if else if ladder is going to be executed. If this condition is true, execute the body, come out of this if conditions. Execute the remaining code. If this condition is false, now check elif condition means else if in remaining programming languages uh, we call it as else if here shortcut they have given elif else if can check the condition p greater than or equal to 70 and p less than 80 if your percentage is between 70 and 80 then print b grade execute the body of this else if condition here we have written only one line you can write any number of lines if it is true, execute this body, come out of this and execute the remaining code. If this is false, next again check the next else if condition. Else if p greater than or equal to 60, percentage greater than or equal to 60 and percentage less than 70. If your percentage is between 60 and 70, print you got c grade, execute the body of this. If all these if else if else if all these conditions are false, then execute else body. So when we are going to else statement, if all these if else if else if all these are false, then only it will go to else body. Otherwise, wherever the condition is true, execute that code and come out of this if statements. If else if ladder, come out of it and execute the remaining code. If there is some other code below this, execute that.